Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> Morning. <laughs> Made it just in time to see the white bass busting. Well, River Rats, we are on the river. Uh, objective number one, hybrids. Objective number two, flatheads. We'll see if any of them work out, but the one I do promise you will, I'm gonna camp out in my boat by myself for the first time. And that's it's the little things that get me jacked up. Big hybrids get me jacked up too, and flatheads. And probably watch where I'm going. Hidden sand. Oh, they're going hard in there. I hope they're bigger than yesterday. All right, let's see if anything's biting on inline spinners at least. Come on, anchor lock. Oh, we gotta go higher up than that. Oh, we got hit, got hit, got hit, got hit, got hit. Oh, there was a log, there's that log. You have to work around that log. And the wipers busting further up river. There's a dude waiting, so if I get up there, I don't want to block him off. I'll probably just tell him to hop in the boat since it's just one dude. We on spot lock? Cause you're like 14 feet off. Figure it out, trolling motor. They're going everywhere in there. They're small. I'm not gonna give this a lot of time. We're gonna go look for the big dogs. Eat it. Doink to doink to doink. I can't even fit it in their mouth. They're trying real hard though. Why am I spending so much time fishing for a fish that can't fit my lure in its mouth? I'm not sure. All right, let's go up river. Okay. Are they popping? Why don't you guys just hop in the boat? You guys hopping in or what? Then you don't have to feel like you got to cast a country mile. Hurry up. We got fish to catch. First class service. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Get these catfish poles out of the way for a little Ooh. bit. Thanks, Spencer. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're going over there again, Spencer. Where? Right there in the, in the back pocket. Well, we'll get where hopefully we can cast at all of them. Yes. Oh, get ready, guys. I'm going to get us over there. Hang on. Technology's great when it works, guys. We're just going to go old fashioned and drop an anchor over there. Nice and stealthy. All right, we seem to be holding after some technical difficulties. I don't feel as patient when I'm in a boat. Oh, that was sweet. Come on. We just made some noise and spooked them at first and, and now they're getting a little more comfortable with us, I think. Yeah, that's not a bad white bass. Oh, yeah. Come here. Yep. Looks like a white to me. Looks like a good fight. Absolute fun sized. Get that gar so I can eat him. Wow, he like lassoed himself, kind of. I'm gonna show off my fish while Sam's messing with his reel. See it? Oh, I should have kept him. Dang it. It's gonna fry some fish. All right, gotta, gotta catch another one now. Actually, I probably need to catch like five for how much I eat. Saw something going down over here. Just one pop. It just seems like this is where the big dogs have been showing up. Oh, you're good. It's already on my way. Oh, I saw that, that was sweet. 
He teed you up. Need assistance? No, we're just the happy football. The happy football. Oh, sorry, Spencer. You wanted to. Oh, yeah, I forgot to. <laughs> Get him, get him, Kit. Well, there is a, a net behind Kit if we do need it. It's a little excessive for wipers, but it, it'll get him just the same. Oh, right in front of you. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh, he swung at it. I, I saw him. The one that bumped me was a white bass. The that pop, pop, that wasn't a white bass. Sweet shoes, Kit. Thanks. Yeah. They're uh, full of sand and rocks right now. It's impossible to keep sand and rocks out of shoes, I swear. Yeah, my plan was to come down here, beat up on the hybrids, and then camp out in my boat and fry some fishes. But I don't know. I picked up my propane tank, and it feels pretty light sad when you have to reach for the fluke yeah. in situations like this. Oh. oh. Let's see, do you want to zoom? Probably not. Probably not, but I'm going to try. Shoot it. I'm going to let it slide down a smidge. Okay, go back to the inline. Going back to the inline. I'm gonna get him. Oh, that was a big dog way down there. Where's that log? Not a big Zara Spook fan. No? No. Or Taylor Swift fan, if we're talking about being fans. <laughs> oh. Nice fish. Oh, there they're going everywhere now. I want to hear one pop, like that one pop right in front of us, right on your popper. How many times did I just say pop or your variation thereof? Pop. Boom, bam. Ooh. Ooh. That was a big one. Oh, he fouled it up. Yeah. That was a big one. Yeah, it was. He screwed, look what he did to it. Yeah, I, as soon as it stayed under, I'm like, that's, that's our luck. Sometimes the fish have to help you, man. When you're this close to the left hand, okay. Yep. Oh, are you kidding me? That shad running for his life. Oh, there he got munched. One, no. Oh, that's so cool. Come on. Oh. Right. right over the top of it. They must have been preoccupied. I hate carpet. The worm dirt gets in there, man. Dude, if you catfish, the shad slime, the oh. catfish slime. There's no room for carpet and catfishing, or any fishing really. Bass fishing. Right. Oh yeah, it's a great fish. Yep. Farm pond largemouth is what I grew up doing. I always had more fun catching the bluegills. Thought they were meaner. I like to use the bluegills for bait for the farm pond largemouth. Yeah, you know, the surface action has left something to be desired. Pretty close. Oh yeah. Want to give me a push? Yep. Sweet. All right, Spencer. All right, Spencer. Yep, we'll see you guys. Oh, yeah. I'm going to try. Thanks, bud. And then there was just us, guys. It's not a bad way to be. We're going to just motor down a ways and get set up, and hopefully the flatheads are biting better than the wipers were. And I'm going to be eating jerky instead of fried fish. And maybe we'll get another shot at the wipers and stuff tomorrow morning. Well, it's dark, and um, I think I'm gonna set up my cot right here. Take a snooze. Had a wooden nibble. It was pretty awesome. Hopefully, see you with a 50 pounder on the line. Morning. From a flathead fishing perspective, that was not good. Oh, there's a nibble. That's about the most action I've seen all night. Yeah, well, I'm gonna get ready. Ready to try to catch a wiper. 
probably pick Kasim up too while I'm at it. The stop? <laughs> I suppose I will head to the back of the boat now. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a sec. Keep casting, man. I can net him too. It's not like we're talking 50 pound flatheads. Yep. He'd hit it about three times. Ooh, he's waking on top and stuff. That's kind of neat. He's thinking about running again. He's gonna run to that tree. Stay out of it. He's not even that. <laughs> Maybe he's growing. so hard to land them in this current. They're doing anything. Come here. He throttled it too. Come here. Oh yeah. Yes. If I get the chance to fight about five of these, I'll be pretty stoked. Come here. Fish in the boat. Yeah, he ain't bad at all. When he was swimming around the water, I didn't think he was this big. And he was freaking hooked good. After I had that day where I lost a bunch of them, I uh, swapped the trebles out for the single. First fish of the morning, and they are salvaging a um, poor showing on the flathead front. So just hanging out with Kasim, picked him up, picked him up on the bank because I didn't want to be standing in front of him <laughs> or floating in front of him when he's trying to cast because that'd be a real jerk thing to do. All right. Peace out, bud. Do I stick with the inline? I feel like I have to now. I don't know what it is about an inline spinner that they like so dang much. It's kind of a weird <coughs> lure. But you could make the argument most lures are kind of weird. Well, one bumped it. Eat it! I could be bumping into shad too, I guess. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> Morning. <laughs> He just took off running right on top. That was pretty sweet. And he's still running. How big are you? Pretty, pretty good. Keep feeling it like tinging off of his gills and stuff. Yeah, he's nice. You got one? Nice. Nice. We only have one net, so we can't, <laughs> we gotta get him in here at different times. That's true, we could fit like 10 of them in there. Well, mine might not be that big now that I look at him. I start manhandling him a little bit. <laughs> yeah, they're similar, I think. He was just excited. Hey, well, the side, oh, yeah. He is in the boat. Yep, I am forever putting singles on. This thing was not going anywhere. Fun-sized. 
I have a handful of Red Bulls, and I and I don't need them. <laughs> Did he just crush that blade bait? Oh yeah. oh yeah. I love how they run on top. Like most fish, when they run, they dive down, and the wipers they just take off running on top, like a shark or like something in salt water. Tiger sharks do that. If you hook one, they run on top. Something moving in there. Yep. Get him. Ooh. Can I reach him? Probably not. Nope. I don't think there's any white bass in here. Yesterday it was all, like yesterday evening, it was almost all white bass. Well, you done? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Thanks, man. No problem. Don't work. You, so. Don't work too hard. Yeah. See ya. See ya. Make a few more casts and go try something different. Um. Yeah. I just got tattooed. That was saw him. And uh, it's acting like I'm gonna see him run into a log. <laughs> Gosh, they're so angry. Wonderfully angry. Oh, that was a stick. And here he's gonna run again. Maybe. Man, he's probably like Four pounds, too, is the crazy thing. In here, I'd given up all hope. Possibly too much fun. You ever gonna quit? Probably not. My camera might before this fish gets in, but. Man. What a nice one. Talk about making up for a crappy night of flathead fishing. Every time I try to string a sentence together, he takes a run and it distracts me. ADHD. I don't actually know if I have ADHD. I feel like I do. At least when it comes to, to fish. He's still a ways down there. Making was. I want to see this one. can't really move him good. <laughs> I don't know if I'm moving him or if he's just swimming with me. He's leaving a big old wake back there though. You probably can't see it because he's still a ways behind the boat. Forearms getting tired. I know, I'm soft. I think he might be tired now. He's just cutting. Yeah, the old camera battery died when I was trying to get this pig in. And it is kind of piggy. Not freak freak show. Well, he's getting bigger and bigger the more I look at him. Whew. Oh, buddy. The more I look at him, look at this pig right here. <laughs> oh, some about fish with stripes, man. Like, I love these things. They just fight like crazy. That, that makes my morning, makes my night. No flatheads, okay, I can live with these things right here because they're angry awesome and I don't know. I just love them. Alrighty, one more look before I let uh, Miss Piggy go. It's a dandy. Get some strength, buddy. 
can't believe you guys function in this stuff. Oh, gone. Love it. Can we get one more? Probably not, but I'm okay if we don't. Maybe I should brush my teeth. It's not a terrible idea. Ooh, there was one. Little white bass. I thought we were done. He said no. He just cranked it. I don't think he's as big as that other one, but he ain't bad. Guess we're going to the back of the boat. Ah, what a, they're so beastly. Hope this isn't as much of a debacle netting this one as the last one. He's just all over the place. Put a little more heat on him. Hopefully I don't pay the price. I feel like it's probably better for the fish. That's why I'm doing it. Get him in a little quicker. Yeah, he ain't nothing like that last one, but he ain't bad. Just angry. So angry. Get over here. He's net worthy. If I can get him over here. <sighs> Success. These ones fight so hard. Calm down. Hook fell right up. Another little pig. Like this is a size range where pound for pound they just fight like crazy. They start getting bigger than this and they fight harder, but not quite like you'd think. But this size is just awesome sized. Peace out, Doug. He was at, wasn't out of the water that long, so he's pretty charged up yet. I think somebody was calling me during that mess. Of course they were. When else would you want to call me? Little. Little white bass. Walleye, maybe? Nope. White bass. Footballs of fury. <laughs> Looks like he's dancing almost. Oh, he's peeing. See ya. I like when you see them hit the top and you throw at them and then they eat. I enjoy that substantially. Well, River Rats, I'm going to brush my teeth and stuff because uh, I definitely need it. And then I'm going to go try and chase some flatheads because if they're not going to move around, I guess I'll just have to go to them. And hopefully that'll be another video, but hope you enjoyed this one. And if you did, hit the like button. If you want to see more videos like this one, hit the subscribe button. For real. Like, I really appreciate you taking time to watch. Like. I just really love editing videos and I think this is a lot of fun and the fact that you all take the time to watch and listen to my ramblings and whatever means a ton. So thank you. Got my podcast linked in the description if you want to check that out. Um, and if you enjoy it, give that a follow. And if you want to support me, all my equipment is linked in the description. It's all affiliate links. It doesn't cost you any extra, but it helps me out a little bit if you purchase through that link and get you some sweet shades waterlands promo code rc15 and you say 15 percent and i get a little kickback too so it's pretty sweet but uh that's pretty much it hope you catch a giant mm -hmm.